Hi, I'm Dr. Satish Nair, Professor and Senior Consultant in ENT and Head and Neck Surgery at the Apollo Hospitals, Bangalore. Today, I would like to talk about a very common topic, a very common condition in which a lot of patients do come to us. Not just to me, they keep shifting from one doctor to another doctor, getting various types of treatment possible, but with no relief. I'm talking about a condition called tinnitus. Well, tinnitus means a sound in the ear. A lot of people over the last years have started saying that they start see, hearing some sound in the ears and it keeps disturbing them. They usually heard more at night and it may be a ringing sound, a hissing sound, a buzzing sound. Unluckily, it's not music. If it was music, nobody would have complained. However, the reason for most of the time this kind of tinnitus or sound in the ear is because some amount of nerve loss that develops in the patient. When you say hearing loss, hearing loss can be nerve loss as well as conductive loss. The nerve loss is when the nerve starts having some amount of hearing loss at that stage. Many of them are having mild losses starting off and this loss can lead to tinnitus. There are various reasons why this loss leads to tinnitus. It's out of the scope of this talk. But then, yes, this is what is usually the condition. Many of them, in the last few years since COVID may have used a lot of hearing apparatus while working from home or may have been exposed to loud sounds which has caused hearing loss. But generally, older people after a particular age do develop nerve loss and sometimes complaint of tinnitus. If you today Google tinnitus and see the treatment available, you will find hundreds of treatments that are possible for tinnitus. The reason why this condition has so many treatment, because most of it does not work. I can see treatment from massaging the ear, to using some equipment on the ear, to taking medications, to taking probiotics, to taking uh, antioxidants and so many other treatments, vitamins, etc. But yes, none of these actually have an effect and or have proved to cause any effect on the tinnitus. Many times the tinnitus that you hear the sound just goes away after a few months. One of the few things that is good for the patient is to understand the condition. So it's something that's happening because of some amount of loss that's starting and the nerve started producing a sound by itself, which will go off by itself after a few days, a few months. So one of the treatment that everybody talks about is self understanding it and you know, biofeedback. So biofeedback just says that I understand what my problem is and I don't consider that it's there. So when you stop understanding that thing is there, the sound goes away. Many patients do feel unhappy when they leave me when I say I have no treatment for you or I do not have medicines for you. And I keep telling them about the biofeedback and how to go about it. But well, that definitely does affect. For people with very difficult tinnitus and a lot of problem, well, there are tinnitus maskers and other things that are available, we can try. But for generally most of the people to understand the condition and have a thought about what the problem is will give them most of the time a relief and they will be happy and the tinnitus would just vanish away. Thank you.